Hello everybody and today I'm going to show the difference between K20 and K10 So this is the K10 and the K20 <coughs> So the difference I have noticed is that this K10 have more uh, colors like more different colors if you have FN and this and So it have a different color, like here, different color fix, and then go like this, which is changing colors, and here we have like constant one color, so you can change which color you want, and then this one which go like in crazy mode, and this, and everything you press it goes like that <laughs> it is changing stuff I mean uh, every key you press the color is changed so this will be for this keyboard and now this keyboard the lighting effects is just like poor if you go like FN and S and so so now it have like some breathing mode and then you have like uh, no color um, uh, low color and the uh, highest and then the breathing again so that's the only colors that you, you have on this keyboard but this keyboard have this thing which is for the hands so when you like uh, typing it's easier than for this key keyboard when you have to like hold the hand uh, up in the sky you doesn't have like the hand holding as you can see uh, this keyboard is louder than this one. I'm going to show you right now, um, just in a second. So it goes like this. And this one is a little bit more sound. Uh, so that's it. And this, um, many people have reported that uh, on the K20, as I have seen some reviews, that this space is not working correctly like if you press here or here it didn't work but for me it does so on this keyboard you have to uh, use more uh, effort or it's harder to press the space than on this one this one is like easy to press so i have found myself that i'm usually uh, when i'm pressing space i it doesn't recognize so i have to press it again uh, but that's no problem because you can get used to it so that's it uh, it have more kind of like a mechanical feel as you can see here it is like that which use uh, mechanical keyboards uh, i'm going to put that back in so it's just like easy to put it out and back in i didn't try it on this keyboard yet but and i will not okay so the next thing i wanted to show you is so the grip uh, this one have a better grip than this one uh, and it's because of wait a second it's because of these things right over there which this keyboard doesn't have and the, but this keyboard have only um, put it like that it have this like only one stage and for this keyboard uh, K20 it have two stages as you can see which I prefer but I'm usually just using the only one stage and then you have um, it doesn't have that grip that I tell you but it's still good so I think that would be the main difference between these two keyboards um, oh one more thing you see the space it is larger and this one you have this uh, key over there well i'm using the uh, yugoslavian one keyboard i mean this is a yugoslavian keyboard this too so it, uh, it doesn't have like um, in this place if you from america somewhere you would have this weird thing which i'm not familiar with so since this uh, key is over there that also means that this keyboard is a little bit much larger but not that much it's just like that 
difference. Not that much, as I'm, as I'm saying. Um, but I also found myself um, misclicking this uh, enter because I'm clicking over there, or like between this. So <laughs> this is a problem for me, but not for everyone, since you can press it right over there. Um, I think personally that this keyboard, uh, I like it m more because it have like this kind of sound and this one have like this, but I like them both. Um, this one have a little bit more matte uh, color, if you know what that means, like matte color thing, like more smooth or whatever, how can I explain it, which this one doesn't have. But it still doesn't look like shit. <laughs> I mean, uh, they look good, both of them. So that will be kind of like the main difference. Um, you have a lot of color settings on this keyboard. Like, you can even change like how brightness. It have the four stages, as I have found out yesterday, because I've been using it yesterday. But um, yeah, as yesterday it also arrives. So this one isn't. Um, doesn't have a dust on it, which this one have. <laughs> so yeah, um, I've been using this keyboard, and I found out that it have a lot of um, different color settings, which I really prefer. So that's the main difference between K20 and K10. So if you have any more questions, leave them down in the comments, and I will reply as soon as I can. So at the end, this is that keyboard and this keyboard. Thank you guys for watching and see you in another one. Goodbye. So the sound of the keyboard again. And sound this keyboard. This one have a little bit different sound than anyone that any other key.